guys, welcome back to Waddler's Toy Cabin and today I'm back with another Super Zing Series 3 video and I finally managed to find the starter pack. I have been looking for this since day one and I've searched, I don't know, probably about 15 shops in total and I couldn't find it but luckily my local co-op restocked and they got some this morning which is super duper cool. So I've got one here, now I can see on the front that we have a double and it is a um, bad pack but actually my dad managed to pick this up for me so I couldn't choose which uh, super thing I got but that doesn't matter because we've got two more chances to get some new ones in there so let's go ahead and open it up and see who we get. So the starter pack, I'm guessing it will kind of be the same as the previous two series where it has like a little magazine with like a comic book inside and also like a big checklist of everything you get. Let's have a look what we've got. Oh, cool. So this is where you get the mask. So I've seen a lot of people um, wearing these on Instagram and other YouTube videos and I wondered where they got them. So these are available in the starter packs. So I'm guessing that um, I know they come in different colours so you'd probably have to buy multiple starter packs to get all the colours if that's something you're interested in doing. So we have a cool little foam mask right there in purple. Then we have two single packets of uh, Super Zings and then over here we have something pretty cool. So this is called a Sliver. Now there we go, there's our double of bad packs so I'm going to put him to the side. But actually he's very very common, we've got a few of this double already. I'll put him there and here we have a golden slider so normally they have like um mobiles or some sort of vehicle to collect in these series oh oh is it a pull back and go oh cool it is oh awesome let's go ahead and put a bad pack in there move the magazine out of the way for a second so you can see the table so this looks like a little aeroplane and it's got two pull back wheels and one regular on the front so i guess you just pull it back and, oh cool, that's pretty cool, so it moves pretty fast. I like that, so I'm guessing there's a whole bunch of these to collect as well. You can get, um, sh normally shiny ones do come in the starter packs. Not sure if you can buy them in the boxes yet though. I'll have to look into that. And let's see who we've got in our single packets first. And who have we got, is it going to be a new one? Oh yes it is, so this one is the tape measure. We do have this one in a different colour, but since this is a brand new colour, it's, uh, it's a nice new one for our collection, so I'll put that down there and we'll quickly find out that one's name. Uh, here's the checklist over here. Where is it? Here we go. So this one is called Metrics. Now we've managed to get this one in both colours, which is really cool. Now let's see who we've got in our other packet. There we go, and oh yes, it's the other colour teddy bear. So I think this one was called Plusher, and we have this one in orange, so now we've completed those two. That's a nice new one to our collection as well. And where did uh, Metrics go? There we go, he rolled over. So we put those two there, now let's see what we've got in the magazine. So I'm not actually sure this is a magazine, because it looks to me like it's a big fold-out poster, so we'll have to have a look. But on the front, it's just got a picture of like Super Sing Series 3, and on the back it shows everything that you can get in the collection, which looks pretty cool because the sliders have some ramps, there's some robots where you can put your Super Zings in, and they show a few of the sets available like the blister packs and some other cool things as well that I'm definitely going to have to try and find soon. Let's go ahead and see, yeah, I'm not sure if this will all fit on the camera, but let's see if we can open it up. And on this side, oh cool, so we've got a map of what would be their city. I'm going to have to try and zoom out completely. There we go. So we have a nice new map. We actually got some maps like this in the previous, um, uh, when they did Zomlings, we got some town maps as well. So that's pretty cool. Maybe I could connect them together. So this is almost as big as my table. And here we go. Here's the other side. So we don't get a uh, magazine this time like we did in the last two series, but we do have a giant checklist up at the top, which is very, very handy because sometimes I can't see the uh, small checklist very well because I do have to wear glasses and I don't always remember to put them on. So we've got a nice big checklist up here, which, uh, which clearly shows all the super things in the collection. And then down here, this is quite interesting, it talks a bit more about the super bots. So here we have one called Iron Punch. Uh, Twister Crack, Rolling Hammer and Spider Cannon, oh that's a cool name. I saw the um, Rolling Hammer one on the advert and I thought that looked really really cool but I haven't managed to find any stores that sell those yet so fingers crossed I can hope 
uh, to find some soon. Then over on this side, well over here, we have uh, 12 super si sliders to collect. So over here, we have a super plane, the Metro 300, uh, skate jet, firefly, uh, sorry, there, my camera was zoomed out. We have wing master, speed demon, and oh, cool, look, you can get um, ultra rare gold ones. Oh, cool, and find sliders, ramps in blaster, in oh, in blister packs. Okay, so you can get the ramps in the blister packs. I have to look into doing that as well. So that's what comes included in the uh, starter pack. I think it's really good. So you do get a good start. You get to see everything that's in the collection. Let's go over what we got today. So my favourite thing about the starter pack is definitely the giant checklist because, as I said earlier, it would come in very, very handy during all the videos. So I can probably put it... Um, in future videos, I'll probably put it at the back against my curtains so I can see um, like the collection as I'm unboxing things, which would be pretty cool. But let's go over who we got in today's collection. So I kind of knocked it over a little bit, but that's okay. So over here, we have Bad Pack, Plusher, Metrics, a little mask, and also um, the cool little slider that um, came with the pack. So yeah, that's been the starter pack. Let me bring my camera down a little bit. There we go, that's better. So hopefully you enjoyed this video and that it was helpful to you so you kind of get an idea of what you would get in the starter pack. So yeah, I think it's a really good thing to get. Definitely worth getting a starter pack when you're starting out a new collection. So as always, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye guys. Don't forget to click that subscribe button and check out some of my other videos.